Hi guys and welcome back. So today I have an exciting video. So I'm bringing you guys my empty house tour so you guys can have a look around and see the new place. I am super excited to start fresh and have a new place. Um, it's just me and Jack here currently. We've just quickly come over to make sure everything's okay. Property hasn't been cleaned yet so just when I am showing obviously it's going to be a little bit dirty. I think um, the estate agent said that the cleaners are coming this morning so it'll be happening but then we're going to go back and then removals um, will be a little bit later and then we're bringing everything over. So it's a very busy day and it's actually super early in the morning but I guess let's start with the empty house tour. Okay, so I'm going to start here, which is like a side door. So there's two doors to get into this place. So you can either come through this side door, which you come into here, and then you have our living room. They've left the stars there. <laughs> I don't know why, but um, this is the living room here. We actually got to choose different lighting, so we've just popped these in. I thought it was really nice, actually. Um, they're from John Lewis. So this is our space. We're thinking of having the TV here then the um, sofa here. You guys will see obviously when we put everything together. So this is our living room space. Then when you walk through here, we we'll obviously have the hallway. Really like the flooring of this hallway actually. Super nice. So beside the hallway here, we have the bathroom. I really like this bathroom. I feel like it's got such a nice texture right on the walls. So bath, toilet, shower. And then we have the sink just here. I think it's really nice. How cool is this? And we both really love this bath. Again, I love the floor and it's the same as the hallway, really nice. So I'm excited to get all my stuff into this bathroom. We're trying to figure out how we can kind of add storage in here because there's not actually any storage anywhere. But I was thinking maybe just popping some stuff underneath here somehow, I don't know, maybe some drawers of some sort or even like the washing baskets or something just under here so we'll see if you guys have any advice let us know maybe we could pop something in that corner there and if we really needed to just behind there as well but this is what the bathroom looks like super nice behind here there's actually a mirror which they're gonna have to replace because we didn't notice actually but they had a massive um like smash right here and obviously I wouldn't want Mila touching that because it's quite dangerous, it's quite sharp. Oh, might as well show you guys my outfit. This will be the perfect place to show you outfits. Um, <laughs> my jacket is from Zara. I'm just wearing like a basic um, white body. And then these trousers are from Primark. I actually really like them, they're super comfortable, but this is the look. Okay, so then you come out back into the hallway and then we have um, these two rooms here are just like storage. And then here is the kitchen. I actually really like this kitchen. It's just really nice and simple, white, very modern looking. Really good space to be honest. And then it just leads out onto a little patio area, which is so nice because we haven't had like a garden or a patio or anything since moving to London. And for Mila, it'd be so nice for her to have an outdoor space, especially now summer's coming up. So this is the area. Nice. Mm. Jack really wants to get like, um, what do you want to get? I forgot the name, but it's not a gazebo, but it's like... Uh, so we basically want to have some sort of shelter With as like well. a blind sort of... Yeah, so you can, can kind of open, open it, the... adjust it. Yeah. It's a bit like blinds, but like... Because then it means we can kind of spill out onto the patio and like eat outside, even yeah. maybe in the sort of autumn months as well, yeah, and make spring it months with some heaters and stuff. But. Yeah gonna give it a good scrub and a good clean and we think that's a really nice little space out there but yeah I really like our oh they've left a bag up there oh, what, a little white company bag I wonder what's in there mm -hmm. we'll have to get that down but I really like this space with yeah. all our like the house is really white isn't it but I like did you say that obviously originally the... yeah when we originally came here the the house was blue like a baby but blue but we saw the potential we like yeah. The layout, we like the location, and we thought, let's give it painted white. So we changed it white just so it was just it kind of. so much better. Looks it fresher, really like a bit big. It kind of gives, it, it makes it feel bigger as yeah, well more, when it's more airy. Like, yeah. Exactly. But I'm excited, and what I like is that this is all silver, matches all of our like toaster and yeah, kettle yeah. and stuff really nicely. I've got nice space. I'm excited to put everything in this kitchen. 
And then we have the fridge here. We have obviously under, um, under the zinc storage. We have a washing machine just here, which is nice tucked away. And then more storage there. Dishwasher. We never use the dishwasher. Jack likes the dishwasher. I never use it. I prefer just the hand wash. I love that this place has so much storage. Like even though our other kitchen was a bit bigger, the storage. It seems like there, there's better storage there wasn't here than the other storage. kitchen. There is more here. Lovely. So this is the kitchen. And then we have these like literally throughout the house. I think we've got five of them, five of them across the house. So we have one in the living room, one in the hallway, and it's each bedroom. Yeah. And then also I mean, oh. the entrance hall as well. Fine. Oh, in. okay. Yeah. Nice. I love this hallway, don't you? Yeah. I it's actually, nice and wide, this, isn't it? This what I was going to say. Like, it's really spacious, like really nice. When we arrived here, they already had this here, this mirror, and then this little table. And we decided to keep it. So I don't know if you want to show yeah, a little bit closer because it's so nice. I thought it actually gives a bit of something to the hallway. Yeah. And obviously everything's so white. Having this kind of texture added in, I think it's really nice. But it's a shame they've got a bit of paint. Hopefully this can scrub out, but there's a bit of paint on here that hopefully we can... To be fair, we gave them the challenge of painting it from blue to white in the space of three to four days, so yeah. they did pretty good. But. Yeah, no, really good. But this is going to be good for like hanging in. Yeah, that's another like entrance door as well. Yeah, for this block you can actually get in two ways. You can actually come into the building and go down the stairs or, a li or the lift and you can come through this door, which I guess is like the front entrance. Or you can literally come through the side door, which is from the main road, if that makes sense, yeah. and come down, which leads you into the living room. Which you'll so probably use that one for this the kids. Will be the, yeah. yeah, this is the main door for me, because obviously with the push chairs and stuff, there's a lift just outside here. Um, so you can just come down, which is amazing. Um, but really good space. So we have two rooms either side. So we have the girls' room there, and then we have our room here. So it's just like a nice size, just to pop our bed, obviously wardrobe. And stuff so this is actually the slightly, a bit wet. <laughs> this is the slightly smaller, smaller room, room, but yeah. we thought all we need is really we just a bed and a bit of storage. So. so obviously like Maya will be in here with us as well because she's obviously still very small. So it's just a good space for us to have everything that we need really. We didn't need anything bigger and this is perfect for us. But we there's a few garbage. Um, I'm risking it. <laughs> what? I'm risking it. <laughs> <laughs> Give a better perspective. But. Josh just actually walked in for you guys on the wet carpet because we had the carpets clean, so they're still a bit damp. Just to show you this side, but <laughs> this is yeah, this is our room, and I really like it. And what I love so much is it's going to be across from the girls' room. Across from here, so we have a bit of a problem with this room, but it's fine because we're going to make it work. Um, when we when we originally came here, there was actually a built-in wardrobe that was already here. Well, basically, the whole apartment the was fully furnished. furnished. Yeah. But we obviously had our own furniture, so we got rid of everything. everything. Apart from those three things Apart that we just showed in the hallway. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, yeah, there was a massive wardrobe just behind here, but because we knew this was going to be the girls' room, we didn't see the point in keeping that big, bulky wardrobe. Because they have their own nursery furniture, which it's, is pretty freestanding. And, yeah. Exactly, so we thought we'd just get rid of it. But unfortunately, <laughs> because of that, we are now left with not matching cars. Do a good panoramic, so you know. <laughs> Nice, lovely room. Unfortunately, we have and that. Then, uh, like, da, da, da. I mean, it's literally not the world's worst thing, to be honest with you, but yeah. it's just a shame it's not matching carpet. This so, room's probably another 30% bigger. So then just that little extra space there is just going to be great for, for just you know, putting their toys They can all play and stuff, so that would be perfect. But what we've actually done just to cover that area is we've got like a really nice rug that covers that area, which I think is going to look really nice in this, this room one. anyway. It's this one. It's on the opposite side. That's the inside. You'll see obviously when we start putting things we, together. Um, we literally um, found out about that two days before moving in. So we literally we panicked and we were thinking, where can we get like a rug same day? So we actually went to Ikea, didn't we? And we yeah. thought, right, we need a big enough rug to cover that space. But I mean, to be honest, if I would have known that moving that, would have yeah, we wouldn't have done it, and then we probably would have had that room in the yeah. kitchen, but we wanted the kids to have oh, more we space. Have had the bigger room, it just didn't yeah. make sense. So this is just spacious for them to all be able to play together in this room, just gives them more space. Do you know what I mean? So we've got this lovely room, and I'm excited to get all the furniture and everything in here to see what it looks like because I think it will be a perfect size and perfect space for them, really. Yeah, Floor's a bit damp. You're going for it. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Carpets are nice. Nicely freshly painted. Gets a lot of light as well for a lower ground. Yeah. Like, uh, we're going to change the blinds and stuff, but there are new lights. And... 
I really like our life and I just love that it's across from each other. It yeah. would be perfect. So really, really nice. I think we're going to put the rug, um, literally, like I said, covering that area. Yeah. Then the cot on top of it, the chest of drawers in that corner there. And then obviously all their toys and everything else will be around. Um, and then just space for beds and stuff to be able to be put into this room as well. So it's perfect, it's a good size. And I'm just excited to get the furniture into place. Excited to show you guys when things are in, the difference, and make it feel like home. Yeah. Because we obviously, like, we just moved, what was it, like last year? Yeah. So now we're moving again. So we're still in the same area though. Yeah, so. we're not far from where we were, just slightly on the opposite side as such. but. I'm used to where we are, so it's nice. You don't have to relearn the area because it's going to be perfect. But I'm excited to get all our stuff in here. Are you? Yeah. Yeah. Crazy to think that. I mean, I don't know what they know, but the fact that we're doing this an hour before the removal thing comes. Yeah, the we... removals are coming literally in an hour, but we thought we'd just quickly come over here. Um, just film it for you guys to see what it looks like empty. I think also, also for all your future vlogs and your hauls and stuff, I mean, I don't know which room you're going to choose, but you've got a lot of options, you've got a lot of white everywhere. It's just nice and fresh, <laughs> isn't it? I'll be able to kind of film anywhere. I love this space here, just to even, I know obviously the mirror is not exactly like bare, but I think it's so cool just to... A mirror looks happen. really heavy. It looks like, it, like it's called a cast iron. I think it's like iron, or is it wood? Oh, oh no, that looks quite light. Uh, a bit of over storage there, I don't know if you mentioned Yeah, that. I mean, we've got storage here, but we tried to open it, and it won't open, so... Uh, it's because where they've done the repaint, I think they've kind of closed paint. it in a bit, yeah, so... Yeah, you can kind of see all the paint trickle through we'll, um, we'll get that sorted. And then uh, there's actually some external storage as well outside, which we won't show, but at least yeah. that's good for, like, Christmas trees, suitcases, exactly. yeah, you know, all of the sort of there. bigger items, so, yeah. Amazing. Yeah, this is the new place. I am super excited to get all our stuff in here now and just try and make it feel like home. We're going to be here for a little while. And then hopefully after this place, we'll be able to buy somewhere and make it a long-term forever home. So that's the plan. But yeah, super excited. But I better get going because we have the removals van coming literally within the hour and we need to get back and get sorted for that. But I will be vlogging lots with this place anyway, so you guys will be coming along on that. So look out for those videos. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think would be really good ideas for this place and that bathroom. Just give me some inspo, I would love that. And I will catch you guys in my next one. Thanks for watching, bye.